Online Theory is a mobile application that allows uh, curated and vernacular test preparation uh, for students. They target a very specific test prep uh, vertical, which is that of government jobs or sarkari jobs as they are called in India. And it is one of the most aspirational job segment for our target segment, which is the bottom of the pyramid students. Um, online Theory is a very well designed solution in terms of the comprehensiveness of the solution. They offer tests, they offer current affairs, reading materials, mock tests and provide the students that very unique ability to be able to consume all this material and then review their performance and benchmark their performance which are typically not available in our brick and mortar coaching solutions so to say. The problem statement for our team was that online theory captures a large volume of data but uh, currently lacks the appropriate data structures to be able to process this data into meaningful insights. Uh, and so our team as a first step uh, did a comprehensive data diagnostic for the online theory team. Uh, we took a two-pronged uh, approach for this. The first was to process the available, da uh, available data set into meaningful insights. And the second was to identify what the key improvements should be in the existing data structure. And uh, while the data diagnostic was a very good first step to understand the key user base and some of these metrics for online theory, our team wanted to go a bit deeper. Uh, and so we went on to the second phase of the project, which, were, which was conducting a comprehensive market research exercise for online theory. Um, so our team is currently in the process uh, of conducting in-person interviews across five states in the country. We've conducted interviews in Rajasthan, Haryana, Delhi, uh, Patna, and Uttar Pradesh, where we're reaching out to the user base of online theory, trying to understand their behavior, what influences them to make the decisions that they make on online theory and otherwise. Uh, for their preparation. There have been two primary objectives of this project since beginning. One was that identifying usage barrier on the platform and the second was identifying opportunities to onboard non-online theory users at online theory platform. Data analysis uh, is very critical in education to improve the outcomes. A lot of education, whether it's primary education, test prep, or you know, college entrance, or higher education, is not based on data today. Education uh, is a product that can never have a one-size-fits-all approach. And in order to give a personalized experience to each of its users uh, through, uh, in a scalable way, they need, to be they need to be able to capture the behavior of each user individually and which can only be done through capturing and understanding the data. Uh, why did the user click what they clicked? Why did they purchase this certain product? What influenced them to uh, download the app or uninstall the app? At which point in the app do they monetize and what influenced their decision? You know, there's a famous saying about data. What gets measured gets managed. And data is the only thing which can be measured and further can be managed. So if we have a data, then only you can ask the right set of questions and can take decision. So the moment actually those qualitative and quantitative insights come, we will actually use those insights and change our products, change our processes. Uh, so and, and also we'll take a few initiatives because eventually these initiatives changes and process changes are backed by the primary research which IC team has done along with the data will help us to identify levers which will actually give us the next level of growth. Online theory is a fast-growing social enterprise, which is continuously fighting for survival in an ecosystem which has multiple ed tech firms competing for the same market uh, share. And uh, so oftentimes in such an environment, you uh, get you just dive deep into doing a lot of urgent tasks, but not necessarily the most important tasks. Uh, as an external team, our uh, team was able to take a step back and sort of look at what these strategic, more important uh, actions for online theory can be in the current environment. You know, I don't know whether it's a best, best practice or not, but just the whole combination of getting these young professionals with both the technical know-how as well as the energy and the enthusiasm to make this change happen, combining them with a startup, which, which all ha also has a lot of energy, but has a lot of other things going on for them, which I call um, the urgent, the business related, combining them with the important 
that this team can solve. That combination of combining the fellowship, the fellows with the, you know, with the startup was in itself a very interesting model that is worth trying in many other social enterprises. Uh, about ISC team, I would say this is one of the best team I have ever worked with. Uh, each one of is different uh, from the others, uh, be it their education background or be it the kind of an uh, earlier developmental projects they have worked on. Uh, you know, this journey has been uh, uh, really good. Uh, in the process, uh, they, uh, you know, while the initial data mining was happening, initially set of interviews were happening, uh, they have asked so many hard questions to us. Uh, few of the questions were answered then and there because we had answers of them, but few of them were not. And uh, at that point in time, we realized, you know, sometimes it is, it is really good to have a third person's view on the same situation, which actually you are working on day in, day out. Uh, 